Part 2. Screen Capturing If you covered Part 1, pretty much you're ready to go. All of the technical considerations that are necessary for you to start have been covered and you can record a video and upload it to the internet to share it with your students. So in essence, everything that we're going to do from this moment on is how to improve those recordings. And to do that, we're going to cover the production of the recordings, the technical considerations, and then some of the pedagogical considerations of making these recordings. In the production part, we're going to tackle from how to prepare, what are the things that you can do so you can ensure that your recording is going to be successful. Later on, we're going to cover usability considerations and basic editing. Not only how to create a video that is flawless technically, but also has a lot of considerations regarding how the students might use these videos in the future. And finally, we're going to cover a little bit more details about where to upload your production and what are the advantages and disadvantages of each one of those options. For the pedagogical considerations, we're going to tackle different ways to make these videos have the highest possible learning impact. And for those things, I would like you to consider the options that I have on the screen. But we're going to tackle these at a later moment.